हाय एवरीवन जय हिंद जय भारत जय माता दी इफ यू आर आई एम यू सी टी एस्पिरेंट क्लास ट्वेल्व स्टूडेंट वांटिंग टू जॉइन मर्च इन एवी लुकिंग फॉर ऑप्शन सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट अ कॉलेज दैट इज सोलानी मैरिट टाइम इंस्टीट्यूट एंड दी ऑप्शंस दैट आर अवेलेबल ओवर देयर फॉर अ क्लास ट्वेल्व स्टूडेंट हु पास इज आउट बट वन थिंग यू हैव टू नो दैट यू हैव टू क्लियर आई एम यू सी टी एग्जाम्स सो कोर्स इज ऑफर्ड आफ्टर ट्वेल्थ एंड कंपनीज कमिंग फॉर प्लेसमेंट फॉर डी एन एस इट इज फ्लीट एम एस सी स्कॉर्पियो तोलानी शिपिंग टॉम बी शिप्स वॉलम्स एंड विलियमसन a lot of shipping companies are named over here and they keep changing but yes they come for dns so out here what you have to do is you have to clear your imcet you have to apply for tolani you have to give their exam their tmi set you have to clear that exam then finally they will shortlist you they will send you to various shipping companies very shipping companies will call for their interviews and then finally you will get selected and you will study at tolani for one year dns course and then you will join the shipping companies along with that they have this 3 years bsc nautical science course 100% placement Top notch shipping companies like Merz Tanker, Chevron, Stena, BW, EPS, MOL, that is Mitsui, NYK, Chela Ram and Williamson come over there. Hundred percent placement, no concerns at all. Even our own students are studying. B Tech Marine Engineering, Merz Tanker, Chevron, Stena, BW, EPS, MOL, NYK, Chela Ram, Williamson, Shell and Fleet come over here. This is a four year course. Let's move ahead. So, age requirement for DNS minimum age is seventeen years. That is at the date of commencement of course so it does not mean that today say the course is commencing on 1st of august 2023 that means you should not be 17 years on 1st august 2023 that is the requirement and the maximum age should be 21 years at the commencement of course should not be more than that on 1st august 2023 theek hai two years relaxation for a female candidate mean that a girl up to the age of 23 can apply over here Educational qualification candidate must have ten plus two with PCM with minimum sixty percent aggregate marks. Some shipping companies prefer candidates with PCM seventy percent in first round, like fleet management. Okay, so DNS may sponsorship plays a very important role. So over here it is not about this; it is about what the companies want. So one is this requirement or candidates who have passed BSc with physics as main subject with for six months. Okay, in one semester. With sixty percent aggregate marks, this is second option. Or candidates who have passed B Tech in any stream with sixty percent aggregate marks. So B Tech from it can be from any stream like mechanical, electrical. But you want to go for DNS, you can do that. Though I would not recommend it personally, but you can do that. You are eligible. English me candidates should have fifty percent marks in tenth or twelfth. Kisi ek me they should have more than fifty percent marks minimum. Physical and mental fitness are required for DNS program selection, along with six by six vision in better eye, six by nine in worst eye, and no color blindness. Normally for deaf side it is six by six in both eyes, but suppose in one eye it is six by six, another it is six by nine, तब भी चलेगा. But no color blindness. Seat available, so one twenty seats are available for DNS. Sponsorship is a must. So in case you have a sponsorship from a shipping company due to some references or whatsoever, if The company is not telling you. They tell you, okay, you do from any college. Then in that case, you can go to Tulani and or T S Rahman, and you can say, see, I've got a sponsorship. I've got M S C T rank certificate. Can I join your college? I don't think so. They will say no. Let's move ahead. If you have done your twelfth with N I S board, then you are not eligible for T M I. This is what we have known. Once you clear I M C T, you have to clear T M I set as well. So I M C T is one thing, but you have to clear Tulani's their own exam is there T M I set. You have to clear that. Okay, if you have a gap after plus two between tenth and twelfth, say you failed in eleventh, you did it again. They will take you, but it depends from company to company. Even over here, it can depend upon company to company. Okay, but the companies that come over here, the Tulani, they don't take an AS board. That is why it is we are recommending it this way. So if you have a gap, generally the most of the companies coming over Tulani, they don't take you. If you are from the NIS board and you have a sponsorship, then you can go and study in Tulani. That is what I said. So you are from NIS board, but you got a sponsorship from X Y Z shipping company, and you go to Tulani and you say, "Sir, can I join your college? I got I M C T rank certificate. I am open board, but I have clear T M I set and I have got this company sponsorship. They will take you. Improvement candidates are not allowed. Again, subjective because shipping companies coming over here, they do not take improvement candidates. That is why. Last date for application for DNS is 15th May 2023. Now again, this may change every year, but these these things will remain same next year after six months, even after one and a half years. If they change, we'll update you. Now, fees for DNS is 
फाइव लैख सेवेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड आउट ऑफ विच फोर्टी थाउजेंड इज पेड फॉर रजिस्ट्रेशन मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज यू विल गेट एजुकेशन लोन नो वरीज हाउ टू अप्लाई गो टू टी एम आई एडमिशन डॉट तोलानी डॉट ई डी यू रजिस्टर एंड मेक एन अकाउंट फिल आउट यूर डिटेल्स पे द फीस क्लियर आई एम यू सी टी एंड देन टी एम आई सेट अलॉन्ग विद टी एम आई इंटरव्यू जय हिंद कॉपेड एलिजिबिलिटी क्राइटेरिया फॉर बी एस सी नॉटिकल साइंस एट तोलानी अगेन एज मिनिमम इज सेवेंटीन ईयर्स मैक्सिमम इज ट्वेंटी वन ईयर्स टू ईयर्स रिलैक्सेशन फॉर फीमेल कैंडिडेट सो इट गोज अप टू ट्वेंटी थ्री ईयर्स अगेन दिस एज इज एज पर द डेट ऑफ कमेंसमेंट ऑफ कोर्स एजुकेशनल क्वालिफिकेशन कैंडिडेट मस्ट है पास टेन प्लस टू विद पी सी आई विद मिनिमम सिक्सटी परसेंट एग्रीगेट सो दैट यू कैन गिव यर आई एम यू सी टी एग्जाम बट तोलानी स्पेशली फॉर बी एस सी नॉटिकल साइंस एंड बी टेक मरीन इंजीनियरिंग दे गिव इंपॉर्टेंस टू देयर ओन एग्जाम दैट इज टी एम आई सेट इंग्लिश में यू शुड मिनिमम फिफ्टी परसेंट इन द टेंथ और ट्वेल्थ अगेन आई सेट इज सिक्स बाय सिक्स इन बोथ द आईज वर्स के सिक्स बाय सिक्स इन वन आई इन सिक्स बाय सिक्स इन दी वर्स आई दैट्स इट नो कलर ब्लाइंडनेस वन टी वन वन ट्वेंटी सीट्स आर अवेलेबल हंड्रेड परसेंट प्लेसमेंट इज देयर ओके लेट्स मूव अड सो नाउ सम की पॉइंट इफ यू डन यूर प्लस टू विद एन आई एस बोर्ड देन यू आर एलिजिबल फॉर टी एम आई येस यू आर एलिजिबल फॉर टी आई टी एम आई इवन आर ओन स्टूडेंट फ्रॉम जे एम डी अकेडमी रिसेंटली ही वॉज फ्रॉम ओपन बोर्ड ही क्लियर टी एम आई सेट क्लियर द इंटरव्यू वेंट ओवर देर एंड टूडे स्टडिंग आउट देर एंड इज डूंग गुड वंस यू क्लियर द आई एम सी टी यू क्लियर टी एम आई सेट एज वेल लास्ट इन एप्लीकेशन फॉर बी एस सी नॉटिकल साइंस फॉर Tulani is fifteenth May twenty twenty three. You need to know that as well. Okay. Last one point is not mentioned. Can improvement candidates also give sit for BSc Nautical Science at Tulani? Yes, they can do that. So you can apply then because for them it is more about TMI set. It's all about that. Okay. For fees in BSc Nautical Science, the fees and student services expenses are approximately seventeen point two eight lakhs and are subject to change. Three years fees BSc Nautical Science is seventeen point two eight lakhs. Female students are entitled to a waiver of fifty percent in tuition fee for each semester. Now, this don't think that fifty percent tuition fee means it will become half over here because tuition fees is different, boarding fees is different, other things are there. But in tuition fees, you get fifty percent discount. Total fees for BSc for female candidates around fourteen lakh fifty eight thousand. But you get education loan over here. Okay. How to apply? Again, go to TMI. dot Tulani. dot Edu. Register. Fill your details. Clear I M C T. Clear T M I SAT. Along with TMI's interview, Jai Ho se bolo, Jai Mata di. Aage badhte hain. Eligibility criteria for BTech Marine Engineering at Tulani: minimum age 17, maximum 21. I am not going to repeat these things again. Education qualification remains the same as was it for DNS, as was it for uh, BSc Nautical Science. But along with that, if you a candidate has a diploma degree in Mechanical Engineering with minimum 60 percent, can directly join second year for BTech Marine Engineering. That is later entry, but this candidate. Will have to give I M U C T exam. That is very very important. Okay, English candidate should have fifty percent marks in tenth or twelfth. And yes, I guess he will have to give a T M I set exam as well. Okay, T M I set exam and even I M U C T. Then only that person can join on later entry in the second year if somebody has a diploma in mechanical engineering. English minimum fifty percent marks in tenth or twelfth, or even in diploma. If you are later entry, then you can then also apply. Physical standards again. If you are going for engineering, six by twelve in both eyes is okay. Worst case, six by nine in one eye and six by eighteen in other eye. Then also it is done. No color blindness done. Total seats two forty are available over here. आगे बढ़ते हैं. Some key points. If you have done your plus two with an IS board, then you are eligible for TMI for B Tech Marine Engineering. Yes. Once you clear IMC, you have to clear TMI set as well. Yes. Last date for application for B Tech Marine is fifteenth May twenty twenty three. This is what you have to know. Even improvement students can apply. TMI set is important. I M C T is important. Jor se bolo. Jai Mata di. Aage bharte hain. Fees for B Tech Marine Engineering is twenty one point one seven lakhs. For girls, it is seventeen point five seven lakhs. Education loan is available. Yes, it is expensive. Jai Mata di. How to apply? TMI. dot Tulani. dot Edu. Register. Fill your details. Clear I M C T. Clear TMI set. Clear TMI's interview and go ahead. Now, last but not the least, how good is Tulani? Whether you should join or not, the best way to know is, guys, go to the MerchantNavyDecoded.com website. MerchantNavyDecoded.com website. This is over here. Go to the college portal that has been created over here. Now, have you seen Google reviews, right? For any hotel you want to go see Google reviews. Similarly, there is a uh, app called Glassdoor where you can go and see the reviews of company if you want to join, right? Similarly, this college portal is over here. So you go over here. So, like you can see, right now we have created a college portal for graduate marine engineering. But within a month, 
will be creating by the time you if you are watching this video just do go to the website and see if the college portal for dns btech marine engineering bsc nautical science has been created or not if yes you will definitely find tulani over there so suppose you click on uh, bsc nautical science you want to do and you click over there and then you go ahead and you will see highly recommended colleges and then other colleges so in highly recommended college so you will see tulani over here like right now you can see anglo Ocean maritime academy then you click over there you will see everything over Talani over there, overview, eligible, like I'm making this video, eligibility criteria, fees, kitna, registration process, kya, sample questions, placement records, everything will be there, like you can see over here, if you click like this over here, then apart from that, the most important thing is you can go and check the reviews, and if you are a student of Talani, whether from DNS, BSc Nautical Science or BTEC Marine Engineering, you should be the first one to go and write a review about the college, how was the waiting period? How was the placement? How was the training and well-being over there? Give in detail. If you want to post a review, no, nobody should you see your name. No problems. Post with that. It will come anonymously. Write down you were from this batch and this is what you saw over there. If it was good, please mention that. People need to know. And if it was, it was not worth it, then also it, please do mention that. It is really important for the younger generation coming, those people who want to join. This is your responsibility. This is our responsibility to guide them. And I alone cannot do that. I need your help. With this, all I can say is thank you very much. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat, Jai Mat.